Hi, Ricky here. This is a little code question number 410. Spirit array, what is the sum? This is hard, difficult question. Let's get into it. Wow, incredible summer. Wow, I think that this is one of very good question. So yeah, we may expect it the good learning through uh, this question. All right. Uh, given an array which consists of non-negative integers and an integers m, you can split the array into m non-empty contiguous array. Write an algorithm to minimize register sum among this n subarray. All right, let's check with example one. Okay. Uh, Num is 7, 2, 5, 10, 8, and then we needed to split. I think there is the, the how many way? This is one way, and this is two way, three way, four way. Yeah, we have four way to split the sub array with the two. Two is mean is the we, sub, we split two part. And if m is three, we needed to, we needed to split one, two, three part, and then each part we needed to make uh, the maximum sum among these three. We needed to make the minimum, right? So okay, let uh, for example, if we split one and this one, and then some of this one is seven, and then this one is uh, eighteen. 23, 25, and then if we split this one, this 9, and then the less than the previous one. And then how about this one? This one is 14, uh, oh, sorry, this one is 14, yeah, right? And then this is 18, and next is the, this is uh, 24, and then this one 8. So smallest is this one, right? In this case, we get maximum number is small because this is 18 and this is 14. At this time, we needed to choose which one, smaller one, biggest one? Yes, we need to choose biggest one. So this is the answer. All right, how we can solve this question? Yeah, right, that's right, yeah. Because this is the difficult question, but Maybe uh, we can check the step by step. Maybe we can solve it. Uh, maybe we can uh, blue plus with with the blue plus solution. We can make easily, but uh, time complexity is maybe exponential. So uh, we can reduce it. Uh, there are a lot of uh, technique to use the reduce time complexity. So. When I face on this question, uh, I try to using binary search. So first, I will to try to uh, sorting first and then blah, 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 but actually fail. So, and then while, but if I do checking with this example, so at the time I will start to read uh, of the start with the result the 18 so I thinking how we can get an uh, output directly then maybe we can reduce some dumb kind of step so finally we got better solution so and then I and then I try to use binary search for this case because uh, Normally, binary search use array, but without array, we can also use it, uh, such as the find uh, root number, root value, and then because uh, binary search only read the left value and right, this is the boundary, and then find the mid value. So if we find the mid, the, the small minimum value of output and then find the maximum value of output i think we can solve it so i calculate what is the 
uh, minimum. So I found out minimum is maximum number in an array. So this is 10 because that is only one. This one also subordinate, right? In this case, this one is we need to divide the two. So this is the cannot be the one. But if the m is three, in this case we can split three times. At that time, minimum is the biggest number, right? Does it make sense? So I let minimum is the biggest number to reduce the boundary, and then what is maximum number? Yeah, that's right. That is sum of array. So in this case, it's 9, 14, 24, 32, so 32. Then we can calculate it, the medium number. Medium is 11, 10, 21. So I will check in this one is satisfied, this one not satisfied. Then at that time, we needed to choose the boundary, this one or this one. Actually, we got answer the 18, right? So we needed to choose this part. But how we can do it? So I am thinking and thinking and thinking, and then I find one solution. That is, okay, then I will try to the count with this one. So the, this one is 21. 21 is the cannot, cannot divide the two, right? Because the maximum is 18. So at that time I make the, the counter and then this one is the reached the over than the 21. I will increase count. So count is the smaller than the smaller than uh, the perspective number. And then I will choose this one. This one is the larger than. That means is this one is smaller than we're looking for. So in this case I will choose this one. And then finally, uh, when I divide, divide, divide until what? It, it left the two, not one. Because this, this one, so to find the range. So uh, we could able to use a uh, template two over the lit code for binary search. So template two is the return to value left and right. And then, uh, Left is the value we're looking for. And then finally, yes, we got the answer. Okay, now let's implement the source code. And then while implementing, I will uh, express the, <coughs> the, I will, uh, okay, let's talk more detail. Okay, all right. Okay, so first we need to make two variables. Left is as you say, we will use the maximum of nums and then right is sum of nums. And then I will make one function, name is count, and I will get mid value and then need the count uh, local variable and then start with one because the, this is the first block, first block is start with one and then I will need to sum zero. Cost, I will calculate from this one, this one, this one, until what? It is not exceed the mid number. So for nums in num in nums, and then if some plus num is small equal than mid, I will add some. Otherwise, I will sum put the num initialize, and then I will. <coughs> at the counter one and then return counter okay let's uh, check with this part okay now <coughs> this is the the 21 do you remember this value this is mid value we calculated the, um, uh, the, uh, the yeah before the today maybe one minute ago yeah and then this one is the 7, 2 is the 9, and 14. 14 is the still smaller than 21. But this time is the uh, 14, 24. So this is exceed. So at this time, I will count. Count is 2. 2. And then I put this 
sum is to put this value. Why we put this one not zero? The reason is uh, if we to include this one and then this one is the 24, it must be overflow the mid value because mid value is the 21. So we will not include this one and then left is the left the next uh, part. So this one is at the sum that is region. So now we could divide this one is this one. So count is two. So if the count is two, which one we need to choose? Yes, that's why we will choose this one. Because this is 18 and then now it's 21. We need to choose this one, right? Otherwise, this counter is a 2, but actually, it, if we divide the 21, we cannot divide the, this one because the, this one is the still s s smaller than 24, so we need to go to the left. And then, let to finish it, okay, let's iteration. By left is right. This one is condition for return the two value, left and right, and then we will choose the left value. Let's calculate the mid value. Left, right, minus left, divide the two. If count mid is smaller or equal than m, we will choose right is mid right. So we will get rid of the right part. Yes. Uh, left is mid plus one and then I will return after finish it I will return left. Let's check. Oh Okay, let's submit. <clears throat> All right, let's check complexity. Uh, how many iteration use? Uh, there are one iteration. This one is binary search. So it take the log m, and then there I need a hidden uh, iteration uh, within function. So this one is n, and then this one is n. So I think the time complexity is n equals n to n and the log n, and then space complexity is we do not use any extra space. So space complexity is constants. Thank you.